Hey, this is Andy from Tense with Andy, and welcome to the Slinko Hyper G String Review. So Slinko Hyper G is a soft copoly. It's green, very optic green. So it really stands out in your racket. Um, it's one that I've used in various rackets in the past and one that I definitely recommend for you to try out if you are looking for a softer feeling copoly um, that still gives you uh, pretty good control and a medium amount of power. It's one that I've, I recommend to people who I care about a lot. So I, I, Definitely recommend this to my wife, and this is actually her string of choice, and also to my uh, nephew and um, uh, niece in terms of it's a good string for, I say, juniors who are transitioning to um, higher level uh, play, and that it'll, g it'll give you really good comfort, and then also um, provide you with uh, the spin and power, and also for for juniors too. Um, you could really um, use the higher, the thinner gauges. So I think this goes all the way up to 19 or 20 in terms of gauge um, to really hone in on that comfort and the spin potential. So for me, um, I've had a love-hate relationship with the string in the past. Um, it's, and it's not the string, it's, it's me. Uh, it sounds like some sort of weird date and thing, but yeah, but it, it's me in that like, this string is, is, is honest. It, gives you what you put in um, and when what I found is when I'm hitting the ball cleanly when I'm having the correct mechanics like I'm getting good spin and, and, and pace with the ball with, with, with the string but anytime especially on my forehand which I say is my more erratic shot like if I'm leaning back or if I'm not brushing up on the ball then that's when you get the unpredictability where the the string where the ball could go in the nets or could go way out. And that's just me in terms of um, my own flaws and, and my strokes. Uh, it doesn't have that same cheatability, I'd say, as like Luxlon ALU Power Rough, where I know even if I'm flailing and sort of leaning back and trying to crush the ball as hard as I can, that somehow the ball stays in. With Hyper G, if you're doing that and the ball's supposed to go out, then the ball's gonna go out. And that's, that's just what I found. So yeah, so it, it promotes clean uh, stroke reduction, but if you have that clean stroke reduction, it's great. Um, it's a string that I feel um, is really soft and I, and above all, like I really love it at the net and that um, I really like to do touch volleys and I feel like the string is soft enough where it's not jarring at your hands um, when you uh, do a volley, but then it's also soft and dead enough where like you can really drop the volley and place it where you want. Um, if you wanted power, you could um, put power in it as well. So that's something that I've really liked about it. Um, in terms of tension maintenance, uh, for me it's uh, 10, 12 hours, it's still pretty good. Um, you start to notice it drop off a bit around that mark, and that's usually a good time to restring your poly if, if you haven't broken it yet. So it's not like a Luxlon 4G where it lasts uh, forever. Um, you can still play with it, but you just have to deal with the fact that some of your the balls that may go out that normally would go in if it's fresh. So all in all, um, I like it. Uh, it's... I guess what would I compare it to? I'd say it's more like a, it's more like a, a, a 4G, but softer and better spin potential. Uh, I'd also compare it to like a Kirschbaum Pro Line Two, um, and, and that is like a, has sort of the, the softness of, of the multi filament and the comfort of a multi, um, but it still gives you a pretty good spin. And the price point is good too. I think it's like twelve or, or thirteen dollars, and so it's a it's a good shrink. So yeah, um, I would definitely recommend you try it. I actually have it right now in my in my racket, and this is the the racket that I use. 
Um, but at the same time, if I know I'm playing a match that matters, I would have Hyper G in one racket and maybe something else that I know I could definitely rely on in the second. But good job, Slinko. Um, stay tuned. I'll be doing the review of the Slinko Whiteout, uh, the 305 gram version, uh, coming up soon. So, again, play smart, see results. This is Andy from Tennis with Andy.